Welcome to Lawn Tips with Lou. A few weeks ago, during mid-March, I scalped my lawn. I first cut it down to one inch with my rotary mower. Then, I cut it down to about a half an inch with my power reel mower. The lawn has begun to green up quite a bit over the past couple of weeks and is beginning to look fairly nice. You'll notice on my reel mower that I've been mowing with the standard front wheels that come with the mower. After scalping the lawn, I noticed that the wheels were leaving rut marks in the lawn. Because this was happening, I decided it's time to put a front roller on the reel mower. One of the benefits of using the front roller is that it is supposed to help level out the lawn. So rather than risking adding more rut marks into the lawn, I invested in a front roller to help smooth them out over the next few mowings. The lawn is greening up. In order for the lawn to thicken up, it is important to continue to mow it short and frequently. This encourages the Bermuda lawn to grow outward rather than upward, which is what gives the lawn the thick, dense look. Scalping the lawn is a very dusty process. Before moving forward with the mowing season, take the time to clean the air filter on your mower, and in my case, mowers. Scalping will get more dirt into the air filter during the one mowing than most people will experience with their mowers over the balance of the mowing season. Open the air filter and clean it. I vacuumed mine, but if, you, if your filter needs to be changed, this is a good time to put a new filter in for the mowing season. It's also a good time to check the mower blade to see if scalping the lawn dulled the blade. Normally, I'd use a grinding wheel to sharpen the blade, but this time the blade was not dulled very much from the scalping process, so I simply used a hand file to put a sharp edge on the blade. If you notice the bottom of my mower deck, you'll see that my mower deck is pretty clean. I haven't cleaned the deck after having scalped the lawn. I mow when my grass is dry. I don't mow when the lawn is wet. If you mow when the lawn is dry, the grass does not clump up on the bottom of the mower deck. During the mowing season, I like to mow in the late afternoon or early evening. At this time of day, the lawn is usually at its driest, allowing for a nice clean cut where the clippings do not stick to the bottom of the rotary mower. Similarly, the clippings don't stick to the reel mower, and the equipment can easily be cleaned off after each mowing with an electric blower. I'll keep this video short. I've covered a lot of material in a short amount of time, but uh, we're ready for the mowing season. Enjoy your summer, and I'll see you next time.